friends welcome to trading income and in this video we will discuss about our today's trades so this is our PNL for today and we'll first see today's date today is 24th August Monday and uh, I will discuss with you uh, the trades which I am in currently and the trades which I have done today so basically I am a positional trader I don't do much of intraday and I think this is best suited if you uh, are working somewhere means for the working uh, for the person who has a job positional trading is the best thing to do and intraday is not a good thing if if you don't have uh, means if you have a job then positional is much better for you and I have a full-time job that's why I prefer positional positional trading so let's see uh, what I have done today I will go to orders and in executed there are only two orders so as you can see here 11300 call and 11300 put of the September expiry September expiry so basically this is the strategy this is an option strategy I only do options on nifty which is the index so basically this is an option strategy which is called as straddle many people might know this strategy in this strategy of option what we do is basically at the money call and put we sell equal quantities so what I have done is 11300 call and put I have sold one lot just one lot I believe in position sizing and uh, this is just a part of my uh, strategy so I had done this uh, September expiry which is the next month expiry not this month so and what we'll see what nifty did today today nifty closed 94 points up and uh, it closed at 11466 11466 so the overall trend is up and it is regularly and consistently nifty is consistently moving upwards so this is the uh, general trend so my straddle was at 11300 so the distance of nifty from my uh, price the price at which I did straddle uh, increased by 160 so my distance is increased so that's why that made me to exit my straddle so now we'll see at what what price I bought it so uh, we will go here so 11300 put 11300 put uh, I sold at 306 uh, I did this uh, four days ago four days ago I did this and uh, 11300 call I had sold at uh, sorry 11300 call I sold at 306 and uh, 11300 put I had sold at 211 so the total the total premium which I got was 517 if we add this to we will get 517 premium I got received this means that if nifty I had a protection of 500 points from 11300 means if t if nifty moves 500 points up that is 11800 and if nifty moves 500 point down from here 11300 which is uh, 10800 means this is the range I have got means this is the range which I have got 10800 to 11800 this is the range if nifty expires if September expiry is within this range uh, I will make money in this strategy but as we know straddles okay this can happen if I can if I wait till expiry but as we know straddles are their PNL varies quickly means it fluctuates continuously so if nifty moves uh, far away from my sold strike uh, 
my loss can start increasing so that's why it's always better in straddles to keep shifting your uh, keep adjusting your sold strikes along with the movement so now nifty is moving upwards so uh, it's better to exit the uh, old strikes and keep uh, moving near the uh, strikes where the nifty is so this was the thinking and uh, i made a profit here of 1350 rupees just on one lot so the points which i have got is i sold at to for total premium i got a total premium of 517 rupees and today when i exited uh, i exit at 499 means i got 18 points 18 points in this uh, and for one lot it is equal to 1350 rupees so this was about this was about uh, this trade this was about this trade now we'll see the other trades which i am holding so the other trades which i am holding are december expiry which is a this this two december expiry 11000 put and 11500 call so this is this is an option strategy which we call as which we call as strangle this we call as strangle means what we do is out of the money call and put out of the money call we sell and out of the money put we sell same quantity on both sides so in december expiry i did this with one lot and this is my entry point and uh, this is my entry point for put and this for call and currently uh, here i am in profit of uh, 2300 rupees just on one lot and uh, i initiated this trade four days ago so this is a good forfeit considering just one lot so but one more point i want to tell here that straddles and strangles positional when we do there is a huge risk if gap down occurs big gap down or gap up occurs then we can make a big loss so therefore always always do your position sizing your position should be such that even if nifty gaps up or gaps down 5 to 10 percent 10 percent is huge 5 percent 3 to 5 percent also your loss should be bearable you should be ready to accept the losses so that's why i have kept this position very small here one lot i can accept even if nifty gaps down tomorrow uh three percent that is more than 300 points then also my maximum loss in this year will not be greater than fifteen thousand rupees which i can accept so you should take a trade in this way so this is not a risk defined strategy straddles and strangles so you should be careful about this and the last trade which i have here is this combination of this four this is a iron condor i see iron condor strategy this is again option strategy where what we do is we do strangle see this two is a strangle i have done strangle of 11000 put and 11700 call but to protect it to hedge it what i have done is further otm put i have bought and further otm call i have sold so now this is not strangle this is iron condor the advantage is that i am protected even if nifty gaps down 10 percent tomorrow this put will protect me and if nifty moves up heavily then this call will which i have bought will protect me see so that's why here i can increase my quantity that's why my quantity is higher here which is 600 so and here also i see here uh here i am making 5000 profit and here i am making almost 6000 loss means right now this strategy is in small loss of 1000 uh, but it's okay and uh, my range here is my range is good actually i don't have to fear i actually i have no fear in this trade because i know even if nifty gaps down very much i have protection on downside protection on upside which is a buy trade 
so these strategies which are risk defined they are very much preferable and the new traders which come into market they should always prefer risk defined strategies because even if nifty gaps down or gaps up huge then also your loss will be small and that is very much important for new trader is very much important the first step is survival first step is not to make profit so these are the three trades uh, one trade i exited and these two i have in position and i intend to hold this for some more time and this was all about this video i hope you enjoyed it if you like this video yeah uh, you can comment below what you have learned from this video if you find it useful you can share it with your friends who want to learn trading and i have one telegram channel where i keep sharing my uh, trades whenever i take it and you can learn a lot i keep on sharing uh, information valuable information related to trading if you want to if you are if you are serious about learning trading profitable trading then you can consider joining this telegram channel the name of this telegram channel is you can search trading income one trading income one is the name of this telegram channel i post my trades regularly there you can uh, learn a lot here and we regularly conduct question and answer sessions to clear your trading doubts so this is one thing and if you like this video you can consider subscribing to our channel for regular updates and wish you all profitable trading